Dear friends, this is Srinivasan, who is having more than 30 years experience in this construction industry, trying to give you a small presentation on coffer dam. This is a general image of a coffer dam on the marine structure. What is coffer dam and the different type of coffer dams? The word coffer means a trunk or a chest, which temporary structure built to enclose an area meant for excavation. Coffer dams are used for structural foundation in open water, bridge piers, docks, locks, dams where high ground water tables are there. A coffer dam is a waterproof wall built around the proposed excavation to prevent the water seep into the excavation. As per the requirement of the job site, the coffer dam may be various type as mentioned below. Earth coffer dams, rock fill copper dams, single sheet pile coffer dams, double wall sheet piling coffer dams, braced coffer dams and circular coffer dams. This is the various type of the coffer dams images which has been shown for your references and knowledges which we will be discussing in the coming slides. Earth coffer dams. Earth coffer dams are constructed where the velocity of the current and the depth of the water is 13 to 18 in or carried about 1 meter above the water level. It is constructed with a mixture of a clay and sand. The slide soap should be pitched with a rubble boulder. On completion of the coffer dam, the water is pumped in to dry the inside surfaces. Sandbags can be used as an emergency. This is the image of an earth coffer dam for your references and it will explain you what has been explained in this slide. Rock fill coffer dams. Rock fill camber dams made of rock fill to enclose the site when dewatered. To protect against wave action, the crust and the upper part are provided with a riprap. The slopes of the rock fill coffer dam should be made as one horizontal to 1.5 vertical. This is uh, the images which is showing the rock fill coffer dam. You can see the riprap in top is 1 into 1.5 slope. Single sheet coffer dam. Single sheet to coffer dam is constructed in a small area and the depth of the water is more than 4.5 to 6 meter. At first guide piles inserted in the firm ground below water bed. The spacing of the runner horizontally as well as vertically depend upon the water pressure. Steel or wooden sheet inserted in the river bed along with the wheels which are secured to the wheels by bolts. After the coffer dam is constructed, the water in the enclosed area is poured out and the construction work begins. You can see the images which is showing how the clouds and wheels are being fixed in the single sheet coffer dams. Double wall sheet piling coffer dams. Where the single wall sheet coffer dam contrasts water pressure Double wall sheet piling coffer dam is constructed where the depth of the water is more than 10 meter. The images will show you how this double wall coffer dam has been constructed. The distance of the both the wall depend on the width of the wall depend upon the depth of the water. The sheet piles are inserted at a reasonable depth in the bed to prevent the leakages from the ground level. Braced coffer dams. The braced coffer dams are to restricted flood image. A braced coffer dam is made out of two rows of vertical sheeting and bracing with valves and stouts. To prevent groundwater from entering in the foundation pit, the braced coffer dams are sometimes used as a land coffer dams. The structure is formed after the pit has dewatered. The coffer dam is removed after the completion of concreting above the water level. Cellular type coffer dam. 
cellular copper diamonds are known as circular type and diaphragm types circular diaphragm type copper diamonds are built by filling the cell completely up to the top before the start of the construction works the crane other equipments place requires for construction purposes without the effect of the neighboring cell due to the interlock stress in diaphragm type steel sheet piles are connected series wise the distance of straight diaphragm is equal to the radius of the connecting arcs the cells are filled with sand gravel and other material after inserting the cell at the required depth the adjustment cell should be filled with an approximate rate to avoid the feature interlocks you can see these images how this cellular type and diaphragm wall things has been worked out and the things has been done the type of the copper cadam increases the desirable limit without increasing the interlock stresses thank you for watching this presentation in case you like this presentation kindly subscribe like and share which will motivate me for further good presentation in case of any queries do not hesitate to write to me the response shall be at the earliest all image courtesy is google contact me at civil conclave at the rate of gmail.com or at my telegram groups or serenity telegram groups the link is been shown below thank you for watching this presentation kindly subscribe and like this